welcome or welcome back to my channel in today's video we're closing out the budget for september we're gonna go all through all the grand totals for sinking funds we're gonna update the uh savings challenges i'm gonna also go you through the expenses and tell you what i spent where uh so yeah without further ado let's start so today is the 3rd of october when i'm filming this so let's begin with counting the balances and all of our sinking funds Let's start with gas. I'm filming a cash condensing right after this video, so that's gonna be fun. We have 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, and 70 in gas. So 70 in gas. Rent has, see, 50, 70, 90, 110, 115, 120, and 125. 125. Utilities have 150, 200, 250, 300, 350, 370, 385, 386, 78, 90, oh god, no, 150, 200, 250, 300, 350, plus 20, 30, 35, plus 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So that's 390 in utilities. 390. Miscellaneous has 220, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95. So that's 295 plus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So that's 305 in miscellaneous. Next up, we have beauty in our short term sinking funds. And let's see what we have in each category. So we have 20, 40, 60 nails, plus facials, we have 20, 30, 40. Laser has 50, 60, 70, 80. Hair and body has 50, 70. Miscellaneous has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So 105, and that's 355 in total in beauty. Great. 355. Birthdays have 200, 250, 260, 265. And we are officially done with birthdays for this year. So I am going to move um, 265 to gifts and we will just take money from there where we need to um because right now it doesn't look like i'll need the money for birthdays anyway uh so birthdays we're putting as empty and we're just putting all of this together i hope it made sense i just said a sentence and i don't think it made sense so basically i don't think i will need to be spending any more money for birthdays for this year but if i do i'm gonna put it in gifts so right now i'm just gonna be adding into gifts until the end of the year because next year then we're gonna allocate this across other categories i have already made a budget the i'm going to condense a couple of envelopes and it's gonna be a whole thing but i'm gonna film a video for that until the end of the september but that's, that doesn't matter right now we have 233 Oh, no, 200, 300, 350, 400, 10, 15, 20, and 25. So 425 is now gifts. And let me write that down. 425. We added 265. Perfect. Great. What we didn't count is Christmas. It's fully funded, so we have 100 in sister. We have 200 in friends. Mom has 100. Dad has 100. And miscellaneous has 50, 70, 90, 110, 30, 50, 170, 180, 190, 200. So in total, we had 700. I just didn't input in, in the calculator correctly. But 700 in Christmas. And clothing has 
50, 70, no, 50, 100, 120, 140, 145, 150, 155, 156, 7, 8, 9, and 160 in clothing. Perfect. So that's for this binder. And let's move on to Johnny Cash. And let's count health. Let's see how much we have in health. So therapy has... 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 140, 145. Plus dentist has 400. Physio has 40. I did receive uh, health insurance now from my new job. So hopefully some medicine, medical expenses will diminish in the future, but we'll see. Medicine has 20, 40, 50, 55. And miscellaneous has 30. So we have five, uh, 670 across the whole health envelope so 670 holidays have 110 15 20 25 and 130 130 in holidays subscriptions have 20 45 and travel has 1,000, 500, 700, 800, 850, 900, 950. So 1,950 plus 20, 30, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, and 50. So we have 2,000 in travel. Great. And now we're moving on to long-term sinking funds, which is our baby pink binder first. And we have... Let's start from the back. So we have 5,000 in emergency fund. That's an ugly five, but it's fine. Deposit has 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000. Plus 200, 400, 450, 500, 550. Plus 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 30, 40, 50. So that's 150 plus 5, 10, 15, 20, and 25. So we have 4,000. 725 in deposit. So 4725. Car, let's check. We have 500, 650, 70, 80, 90, 695, 700, 5, 10, 15, and 20. So 720 in car. I usually check if my balance trackers also show the correct amount. And babies have 500, 650, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95. No, 500, 600, 650, 670, 680, 685, 690, 695, 700, 5, 10, 15. So 715 in babies. Okay. And then our last binder, which we're going to count, is the blue binder. And pets, let's see. Pets have 500, 700, 800, 850, 870, 890, 900, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 935 in pets. Great. Retirement has. 120, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 61, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So 165. Technology has 520, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85. So 585. And last, we have... Weddings, I don't count my savings challenge binder, which is the yellow binder, because I just think it's not fun to count. Well, I'm just gonna count the savings at the end of the year, and it's gonna be, I think, more interesting that way. But we have 500, 600, 650, 670, 675, 680, 685, 690, 695, 700, 510, 
11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So weddings has 715. Okay. And that's all for the counting part. And now let's see the total grand total across all of our sinking funds at the end of month of September. So 160, 425, 670, 130, 45, 2000, 715, 720, 4725, plus 5000, plus 935. Usually I mess up somewhere here, but let's see. We have 18,935 euros across our sinking funds. That's very exciting. So let me open up the monthly uh, check-in page on my iPad and let's go through our totals. So we had a monthly total of income of 2,615 euros. Our savings, we put 365 euros and savings. And that was how many percent of our income? 14% of our income was went into savings, which is a super fun. So let's go through our expenses and we'll see how much we had for which category. So groceries, we uh, spent 199 euros and two cents, which was more than last month. Spending was 96 euros and five cents, also more than last month. And dine out was 235 euros and 89 cents, also more than last time. Uh, but don't forget, August was a four week month and September was a five week month. So that makes sense. Gas, we didn't spend anything. Rent, we spent 300. Utilities, 55.87. Oh, I didn't write down the percentages of budget. So groceries was 8%, spending was 4% of our budget, dine out was nine. Uh, rent was, oh sorry, rent was 600, not 300. So that was 23%, utilities was 2%. Miscellaneous, we spent 5460, which is 2% of our income. Upkeep nothing beauty was 371 euros, which is 14%, also more than last month. Um, but I also have my laser hair removal and that was like 160 euros, so that explains it. Clothing was 104 euros and 10 cents, which is 4%. 45 euros went into gifts, that was 2%. Health was 181 euros and 66 cents, um, almost yeah, 100 euros less than last month. That was 7% of our income. And then holidays was nothing. 155 euros and three cents was subscriptions. That was 6%. Uh, and I spent 75, I think, on a gym membership. Also on my phone. Also, I bought a subscription for crosswords for the entire year for next year because it was a good discount so that explains the amount and travel was 408 euros and 14 cents that is 16 percent of our income and that was because of my trip to bucharest if you haven't seen a travel vlog yet and what i spent there go check it out on my channel i filmed everything that i spent there and uh, the total expenses was if i'm not mistaken 2506 euros and 36 cents but let me double check actually because i feel like that's a lot but it might be oh fuck oh god i'm messing it up two three four eight nine six hundred fifty five eighty seven 460 371 105 10 45 and indeed 2506 euros and 36 cents mm, okay well that's shocking then and then let me flip to our monthly not monthly sorry yearly overview and i'm gonna quickly update this one so i'm i'm gonna write the expenses here on my own because it's literally the same thing but i do want to update our little savings so our first savings goal is christmas and we are actually officially done with it so we have 700 at the end of the month for christmas we added 150 euros throughout the month and we are done with it so that means we have finished this one perfect 
Then our second goal we have done. Third goal is uh, 5,000 in deposit and we currently have, let me flip to my sinking funds. So deposit has 4,725. So we added 225 euros throughout the month. So that's perfect. And then our last goal is one month in advance and we also have that. So, so far we're only working on one goal which is deposit at, by the end of the year because I am officially done with all of the rest. So let me color in the trackers. We can color in the first tracker, which is Christmas, which means that we have fully funded Christmas, which is just in time because there's going to be Black Friday up ahead and I, it gives me plenty of time to buy the gift gifts I want and also I have like already some ideas done on September and then deposit let's see, see how many leaves we need to color in we need how 11 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 full leaves and a little of this one so we're very close to be fully done with all of our goals for the year, which is super exciting. So yes, that was all for the closeout of September. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a like and consider subscribing to my channel. We have fun over here. I'll be back very soon with a cash condensing video for the month of September. So stay tuned for that. But yes, thank you for spending your time with me. I love every single one of you and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.